Hey guys, welcome to Superlative Radio. Dylan Stone here with you. Hope you enjoy the following vlog. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog right here on Superlative Radio. Dylan Stone here. And, uh, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, aim this vlog at the kids. Okay? From about... I'll say from about 12 till... 19 ballpark I was talking to the boys off camera and I was talking about being a kid being you know 13 14 15 and how shy I was and I was really really shy when I was a kid with people my own age that is and especially with girls I was I was not good uh, I couldn't talk to girls I couldn't even fathom talking to them I was really bad I know that's strange when you look at me now and you sort of see sort of what what I'm doing and how I'm you know you know sitting in front of a camera and talking and I I get up on stages and introduce people and talk to a whole room full of people and you know public speaking they say is one of the biggest fears of you know even bigger than death people fear public speaking it's always something I look forward to doing I enjoy it you know I like the idea of being sort of the center of attention now I guess all the years in radio and all the years being a musician and playing on stage and all the you know has it it, it sort of feeds my insecurity I guess if that's what it boils down to you know it's it but I remember being you know 12 13 14 15 and being in high school and not being able to talk to girls that I thought were cute I just I just couldn't like the, the, the butterflies and the, like I mean <laughs> I'm sure if I'd have just said hi I'd have puked really that's how bad it was like I was really really bad in fact I can re <laughs> oh man I can remember being in grade nine and there was this girl in our class who like I mean I had a crush on her really bad and she was just just drop dead gorgeous. That's the only word I can use. She was just beautiful. Stunning blue eyes and long blonde hair and a face that just, you know, she was hot. You know, I mean, I, I would just look at her sometimes and I would be just like, oh man, you know. And she, one day we were working on something. It was in, I think she, this was in French class if I remember correctly. Anyway, I, we were working on something, and she walked over to me and asked me a question. And I'm, I'm, and I'm writing, and I'm doing. And she, you know, and she, she's, um, she tapped me on the shoulder. She, excuse me. She said, "Can I, can I ask you a question? I, I don't understand something." And she was asking me to help her with something. I didn't realize it was her, and I turned around and I looked up, and it was her. And I, I, I my pal heart's palpitating, and I'm, I'm like, and I, 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 I couldn't talk, and I, I. I I just got instantly red and I, I just, I turned around and I went back to my work. I remember she was sort of giggling while she left, you know. I don't know if she did it just to do that to me because she knew that I'd be that way or whatever, you know. But it was one of the weirdest, I can remember situations such as that growing up. And, you know, you look back at that situation and you, you know, and you get up to where I am now and you look back at it you go you stupid fucker like what are you thinking what I'm sort of saying to the kids is don't don't worry about it don't be just don't care like to the point that just go talk to somebody that you like if there's a guy you like if there's a girl you like if it's talk to them strike up a conversation and if they tell you to go fuck yourself or leave or do, just, okay, whatever, and leave. Don't worry about it. You know, it boils down to the, you know, if you don't roll the dice, you're not in the game. You got to try. And I look back from where I am at this point now, and I look back and I think, you know, there were so many girls that I could have talked to, and maybe I'd have had friends, or maybe I've had a girlfriend, or maybe I've had, that I never took the opportunity to at least try that I look back at it and I go, you know, it's my loss. I should have at least tried, and I never did. Sometimes chances only come once, and then they're gone. 
And if you don't take the opportunity when it knocks, you snooze, you lose. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. You know, how many other things can I say to you? So for all the kids out there, all the, especially the guys like me that were so insecure, that had no self-confidence at all when it came to talking to girls my own age, don't let it get to you, dude. Girls, same thing. Go talk to the guy. Guys, go talk to the girl. You're only here for a short time. Take advantage of it. Experience everything. Because life is too short. Really and truly. I know people say it. And from the perspective of being 10, 11, 12, 13, it doesn't look like it's very short. It does, you don't see it the way it is when I, you see it from this side of the fence. It goes like that. Experience everything you can experience while you're here because this is what life is. All the things that are good that you can experience, go out and do it. Because when you get to this point in your life and you can look back and you can go, man, am I glad I did that. Or man, boy, oh boy, that was fun. Or wow, I could have missed that opportunity. I guess the secret when you get to the end is try to have as few regrets as you can. Because then you can die happy and you can die satisfied. Not to say I won't, because I've experienced a hell of a lot of stuff, <laughs> a lot of shit too, but there's opportunities along the way that I'd say, well, I'm glad I missed that, I'm glad I missed that, I'm glad I didn't do it. But some of them you go, shit, man. I should have taken that one. I should have tried on that one. You know. That's my advice to you guys. Now, the older people watching, how many times have you said that to yourself? Let me know down below. How many times have you said, you know, yeah, should have taken that chance or should have did this or I should have did that. Let's not make the mistake, kids. Have fun. That's my advice to you. Have as much fun as you can. Enjoy life. You just get one. Make it work. That's my vlog for today. We'll see you guys again soon. SuperlativeRadio.com Hey guys, thanks for watching Superlative Radio. Come back anytime. And when you do, please make sure you subscribe. Make sure you leave a comment. We really want to know what you think. We'll see you soon. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other because that's the way it's supposed to be.